Hey YouTube, this time the purple one. I'm gonna cut to the chase. It's a nightmare. Um, that's all I can tell you. I woke up this morning and I woke up at, well, I checked the computer at 411. So I woke up a few minutes before that to check the national debt. Um, just to see if we're still on track for about 2.1, 2.2 billion dollars every day. And that's what normally goes up. Every four or five days though, we get a spike. Um, I think four days ago we had a spike of 140 and then four or five days before that we had like 51 or 60 billion dollars um, so let me show you the numbers I woke up it was 32 trillion 484 billion 300 million I said great no big jump then by some chance at 537 I checked it again I usually check it a few times a day um, and it was 32 trillion 544 billion. That's a 600 billion jump in just an hour or two. 60 billion, 60 billion jump. That's insanity. This is a nightmare. If you're not preparing for it, um, it's going to roll over top of you. How do you prepare for this? Um, basically, get your financial house in order, lower your bills as much as possible. Uh, become self-sufficient as much as possible. That might be just an apple tree, a pear tree, a couple um, tomato plants. Biggest thing is stockpiling things you're going to need. Don't waste your money on things you're not going to need. A lot of people say, I need to buy a year's supply of this dehydrated food for this huge amount of money. You really don't have to do that. Buy the stuff you eat and rotate it. Um, try to get a year supply of your canned goods and the, the staples that you normally use. Um, I don't want to tell you to get two or three year supply uh, if you're financially can't even get one year. But if you've gotten the one year and you're doing good, get a little extra. Get staples that will last. It will not go bad. I don't want you to throw food away. I hate when, when preppers don't rotate their stocks and they tell me about it. Um, a lot of canned goods though are good a lot longer than the date on them, the Best Buy date. So, let that sink in. Another $60 billion. Basically what it's doing is it's going to collapse the US dollar. Uh, we're going to have major problems. Major problems means they're going to use an excuse to not uh, take responsibility politicians and all politicians have a responsibility in this huge debt we have a responsibility because we don't holler enough yes holler enough our founding fathers would be rolling in their graves uh, knowing that we are in debt this much it's it's not right it's not uh, I don't think it's, it's definitely not biblical if you are a debtor you are a slave to the lender we are debtors. It will catch up with us. You can't really fight this right now, but you can prepare your family for what's gonna come. Get rid of bills that you don't need. Get rid of that cable bill. If I don't get stung, get rid of the cable bill. Get any, rid of any bills you don't need. You're gonna thank yourself for doing it. Um, I have no crystal ball. I don't know what a year from now is gonna be. I do have the ability to think analytically and I can look at numbers and I can say it ain't good for us. So, $60 billion this morning alone. Thanks for watching.